So you might be asking yourself, how do you guys get this Christmas holiday mask, right? The Hunter holiday mask, how do you get it? Well, I was wondering the same thing, but I ended up playing the Summit because I was actually farming for some China light um, gear pieces. So I was farming for these China light gear pieces. I had my Santa hat on and we were farming. We got to level 100 and then we were fighting these hunters. So this is on legendary. I ended up running the CC build for the team. I was lucky enough, um, I was just doing matchmaking for Legendary, and I found a team, I think they were on level 96, and I was able to join them all through matchmaking. I've gotten really lucky with the teams I found. Um, recently, I did all the Strongholds Legendary with matchmaking, and then I finally did this right here with matchmaking, and we got to 100. I was the CC build, so all my job was to really just crowd control, right? So. I'm laying down the right foam and then also shock trap. So that's what I was doing the whole time. And then they were just putting out the DPS and we were able to take them out. Now, I'm not sure if you have to take out all the hunters or the final hunters, the one that's the extra hunter that's back there is the one that's going to drop the mask. But that's what happened for me. So the first four hunters that we dropped did not drop the mask, but the final one Yes, the final hunter did so. So you do have to kill all the hunters before the mask will drop. But another thing that you guys should keep in mind, if you guys haven't done this since I want to say what was a title update 11.1, um, there is actually another mask you guys will get. So not only will you get the original mask that they added to this, there's also the Christmas mask. So you should get two masks if you haven't already collected this one. Now, the good thing about this, you guys can do this on normal, hard, challenging, heroic, or legendary. It's really up to you. So if you feel like you don't really want to do this, um, you just want to get through it pretty quick, well, I would say normal. But I will tell you that I felt like the drops are actually really good. I personally was looking for some China Light pieces, and I got a ton of pieces to add. So I really think that they buffed up the drop rate. And I think if you guys are looking for those really good pieces, you guys should get them because I got exactly what I was looking for after just doing about, I want to say, six or seven floors. So for seven floors on Legendary, I got some really, really good stuff. And I think you guys will probably, I recommend um, maybe um, matchmaking Legendary. That way you have more enemies and more items will drop. So once you clear the floor, floor 100, just go over the body, it will be all the way at the bottom. And you can see the original mask that was released in 11.1 .1 is right there. But then right under it, we have the holiday mask. So if you guys are looking at getting these two hunter masks, especially the holiday one, I would highly recommend it. Now, I don't know if the holiday mask is only right now and will it go away once this event's over because you guys know you guys can get the Santa hat and you guys can get the Slayer gun. But yeah, once you get it, just head over and then this is what it looks like. It's actually pretty cool. I think it's actually, I, I might use this, right? I might use this. I wish I could use my um, Santa hat with it. It would have been a lot better, but I'll probably use this a little bit, switch it out back and forth all through the holiday season. You guys know Christmas is coming up. So, but yeah, this is it. This is how you guys get it. Um, I'm not sure if any other hunter will drop this. I know for sure, 100%, floor 100, that's where you guys can get this hunter mask. Well, let me know if you guys have any questions. I'll see you in the next one. Nothing But Skills is out.